everybody and vlogtober's picking up. If you didn't see my post on the YouTube community site or on Instagram, middle of last week I, well I'll show you what I did. So our banisters are flat here and I was doing laundry and on the one up there, I set my camera and then knocked it with the laundry basket as I was walking by and my camera fell all the way down here. My camera broke, so I waited for a new one to get delivered. It got delivered late Thursday night and then Friday I had plans with friends and <laughs> we went out at like 3 and I didn't get home until 9. So. Then I filmed yesterday, I'm filming today. I'm gonna kind of merge the weekend together. On Friday night, my friends and I had the best time. My friend's a member at a club and we went to a private dining room that is in the encased in like glass with like wine vaults around you. It was so fun and the meal was so good and we just had the best of time. And then yesterday, Stephen and I started driving around to look at a couple homes. And today we're going with our realtor to see and go into several homes. I've asked if I can film and he said, absolutely. So I'm going to film as much as possible. I also want to be able to like take in the house, but I'm going to give you at least a little glimpse of each of the homes we're looking at. We have decided to leave it really open. So we know the areas we want to be in and we've been like really um, explicit with the areas we want to look for. And then what we said is we want to see super modern. We want to see old that has been renovated. We'll see some new construction. Like we are open two story, one story. We want to sense what we want now because we have the opportunity to change our style however we want. So we're going to see probably some traditional, some eclectic, some modern, some new construction, some old. We're going to see all the things today for Steven and I to really sense like this feels like it could be our home. That's the plan and you're going along with us. These pumpkins got delivered yesterday. They are not typically my thing, but I'm going to cut to a clip from yesterday so you can see them in action. They light up. They are incredible. They're linked below. I would say walk, don't run to get these. I love them. Look at these pumpkins that were just delivered. They look very expensive and like they cost a bajillion dollars. They're from Walmart. Super reasonable, like unbelievably reasonable. And you get all three of them. I'm obsessed with them. I'm going to link them for you so you can get them because they are so cool. I love them. The other thing that is going to start coming in is I think I've landed on Christmas 2024. I think we're doing blue and white chinoiserie with a chartreuse green accent through pears and ribbons and some ornaments. It just feels like where I want to go. So that's what we're doing. Some of that's going to start getting delivered today. So I'll share that with you when we come home. We're actually starting our house hunting quite early. We're meeting, well not quite early. We're meeting him at 9 30, 10 o'clock. So we'll probably go just get coffee from somewhere today. And then I think we're going to six homes total today. Maybe one of them will be the one. We'll see. I went ahead and got ready to go. And Steven, while I was getting ready, took Mabel for a quick walk around the neighborhood. Luckily, a couple of the houses will be able to stop um, this afternoon and let her out as well. So she'll be well taken care of. She also went and drove and walked around some of the locations yesterday. So she's a part of this whole process as well. All right, I'm gonna finish getting ready, make sure the house is all set. Steven will get home, get ready, and then we have to be there by 10. It's a little after 9.30. We are back from house hunting and we saw six houses today, all very different. Um, five of them were in the same location and then one was a little further out of the city, which the craftsmanship of it was not great, um, but there were the five in the city we really liked. Um, some were really modern, some were old, 
some were old and completely renovated. There was one that I particularly gravitated towards. I think Steven liked it as well. Uh, yeah, we're not rushing any decision yet, but there, there's definitely one we were vibing with. We're gonna go out to dinner tonight and probably talk about it more. I am gonna cut away from the footage, but I filmed it vertically on my phone because if you're following me on Instagram, you already have caught a glimpse. So I'm gonna cut to the footage and it won't fill up the whole screen because I filmed it vertically, but enjoy. So there's a counter out there. And you have these windows that you can slide and pull shut. And the yard is really deep. So that way you can your business. Now this is built next door. And this one's fully staged. We have the frosted glass on, but we like the flow of this one. I like this one, I think, the best. I think the whole house is nice. What do you feel? Um, do you like the modern or do you like something like older? Me too. I like how our sinks and our bathroom closets would be separate. Second floor, this is the master. She would love this yard. <laughs> she would. Do you see the copper um, rain spouts, babe? It's hard to believe you're in the city.
I mean, I love. Yeah, I would buy this full, fully furnished, fully designed. I love the colors. I love the beams on the ceiling. This is the primary bedroom. That light fixture is stunning. And then, here's the closet. And then this is the primary bathroom. I wonder if is the toilet room. I wonder if this is another. Oh, so there are his and her closets. Oh, baby, his and his here. So this is house number six. So there's these huge double doors and then French doors with coffered ceilings. This is the office. This is the dining room. This one's still under construction. So we'd be able to make a couple decisions, but th this would be the dining room. They're not done with all the moldings. This is the family room. I love the stone on the fireplace. And then it opens up into the kitchen. It's beautiful. And then back here is the pantry, laundry room. There's a cute little powder room here. And then the primary bath or bedroom goes against the woods. And then this is the spa shower. And then the sink is here. Toilet room. So like I said, we have some thinking to do. Um, we're in no hurry. We want to find the house that feels really right. There is one that I liked. You can guess down below which one you think that is. It might surprise you, uh, but I'm going to cut this video so I can start filming a little bit more. Mabel <laughs> is sleeping behind me. Um, I'm feeling so blessed and just like so happy, but uh, take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind. Kindness is free, give it to everyone. Until next time, bye-bye friends.